What's up everyone? It's Mike. Finally, today, I get to share with you the new tube amplifier that I recently purchased. The Music Angel XD500 Mark III Edition. And this is a vintage style tube amplifier. I bought this amp to replace my old Music Angel, the KT88 tube amplifier. The reason I did this is because I wanted to hear what a EL34 tube amp sounds like. I really liked my prior Music Angel that I had, so I went and bought another one. This amplifier is made in China, so it's cheaper than one priced here in the States. I bought it from ChinaHiFiAudio.com for $678, and that price includes all the tubes, but not shipping. I had to pay $278 for the shipping, which took six weeks to arrive in Denver, Colorado from Shanghai, China. I was really nervous if it would even arrive since I have read a few sites that previous customers stated they never received the item they paid for or that it took forever to ship with very poor communication. I can reassure you that the website is legitimate, but yes, shipping is very slow. I will tell you a few specs that I got from the China Hi-Fi website. If you want to read all the specs, check out the website. I'll put the link with the video info below. Also, I'll let you guys hear what it sounds like and make sure you comment in the comment section and let me know what you think of it. So I will tell you some of the features of this amplifier. As an integrated amp, it adopts famous tube EL34. It is designed following the concept of the best two machines. Two channels are completely independent. The chief components use Dell military resistance from USA, Wema capacitor made in West Germany, Alps potometer from Japan, and Hitachi oxygen free copper wire with a hand weld by skilled technician. It performs excellent. The machine adopts push-pull circuit and can easily handle large dynamic bursting music. However, it keeps it smooth and sounds clear and warm. The price is suitable and worth having one. Specification Driver Tube is the 6-in-1 I don't know if you guys can see that ECC85 times two voltage amplifier tubes six in one ECC85 times three power tube EL34B times eight so this is a very powerful amplifier it has eight EL34B power tubes and my last amplifier had four KT88 power tubes but this amplifier is more powerful that's why I went and got it. The last one was 65 plus 65 and this one is 75 watts plus 75 watts times 2 in ultra linear mode. 35 watts times 2 in triode mode, class A. Signal noise response is 90 decibel. Frequency response, 7 hertz through 70 hertz plus or minus 3 decibel. Input 3 inputs. The dimensions is 465 width, 288 millimeters deep, and 175 millimeter height. The gross weight is 26 kilogram, 57.5 pounds in US, and the power is 110 volt. All right, so that's the specifications. Now I want you guys to hear it and let's see how good it sounds. Sorry, my camera's moving around because I lost my tripod for my camera, so I have to hold it. So sorry about the moving around and all the motion. And I'm using my new microphone, so let's hear how that sounds. 
I'm gonna do a little music demo here and this is the very best of female audiophile greatest audiophile voices okay and I'm gonna be playing it from the Klipsch reference series 7 with the Klipsch RT12D this is a really powerful subwoofer it's 800 watts RMS and it has a main sub right here and two passive radiators okay but that's not what you came here you guys want to hear what this music angel sounds like so let's get it connected and give it a listen <laughs> <laughs> 